What's up, people? How are you guys doing today? He's with me. <laughs> we just started the video from the last where we left off. All right. So today is the day uh, that we're gonna be working on the F30, and we're gonna be tuning this car. Uh, this car already has a JB4 on it, so we're gonna take off the JB4, and we're gonna do the boot mode three, right? Yeah. So we're gonna do the BM3 boot mode three. They got shit ton of names, whatever you wanna call them. And uh, so the car is actually not all the way hot yet. So see the temperature gauge is not all the way up so we're not gonna gun it so we can't really show you like what really uh what's really the difference but if the gauge goes up by the time we get to the place uh we'll show you but we're gonna do that and we're gonna fucking install the intake on the f30 this is actually a 2019 uh f30 bmw 2 what is it 330 340 yeah <laughs> all right all right and let's go home and install that Probably revving it too, just can't hear it. <laughs> we got my boy ramming behind us in that alpha. Well, we're trying to connect the JB4 app, and there it is, the connected. Let's take it fucking fast. <laughs> and the pops are nice. You guys already know these pops. <laughs> That was actually the pull from the JV4, and the JV4, as you guys already know, does the car pretty good, but it's not safe because, like, you know, boot mode 3 is actually safer than the JV4. That's where we're gonna go with the boot mode 3. Another pull. So yep, the poles were not in uh, California. I'm gonna say they were not in Mexico. Sorry about that. But yeah, they were not in California. They were in Mexico, and uh, it was actually the stunt driver who was driving the car. It wasn't the person or my cousin who owns the car. You know, we never do that. So now we're gonna swap the stunt driver with my cousin, and then we're gonna go home and install the J4 or fucking Puma <laughs> three. <laughs> we're gonna open up the tune on the. The 30 first we're gonna open up the JB4 and to take up the tune first thing you need is just take this thing off then he's gonna do it I'm not really gonna explain how to tune the car with the JB4 I got shit ton of other car uh, videos that you could go watch but uh we're gonna do the intake though so that's what you need open up the sensor and uh unscrew your uh, clamp and your sensor comes out and then clamp comes out and then there's like three four clips to your intake, one, two, maybe two. No, the third one's right there. And three, maybe four, and four. Take that out, and there goes the intake. Where's the other one? Uh, somewhere. Somewhere. Yep, we're back to Ash Garage. Yep. <laughs> and the filter comes out, and you just pull it hard because it's just like clipping it under. There's just a clip under it, so and comes right out. Before you guys start working on the car and start taking off your JB4 or tune or putting on anything, make sure you have like three people working. At least, yeah. <laughs> You're gonna need three hands. <laughs> it's always good to have this extra set of hands. Okay, and that, there goes the first clip. Pinch it in, and these are actually pretty easy to take out. See, he just took it out already. <laughs> yep, just like that. Just like that. <laughs> They're not that bad, I was just playing, but yeah, they're not that hard to take out. Do you want to blow some air into it? <laughs> no. So, update on intake, after you got the filter out, all that shit right there, and then you open up this bolt right here, and after you open up the bolt, you're gonna open this up, and how do you open this up? Uh, just a clamp. Clamp under it? Okay, so there's just one clamp under it and then unbolt that clamp 
And then we're gonna put the aftermarket, the AP racing intake on this bitch. After you take out your intake and that thing on top, then you basically put the AP intake first thinking, whatever that shit is. If you bought the AP intake, you probably have that thing, so put that shit back on. <laughs> so after you got that, the pipe in, then you put this pipe up, and, and this pipe, this is where your intake is gonna go, right? Yeah, and this is where your sensor is gonna go, and uh, I'm gonna just show you after we're done with it, and uh, this is how you do the intake on F30, the AP racing intake. And there goes the intake. Intake was the easiest part to put it on, and then you just bolt in the clamp. I mean, I actually helped helped them a lot. So don't get me wrong. As you can tell, my hands so are pretty much. dirty. Yeah, so much I did fun. most of the work here. <laughs> we actually did most of the work here. Oh yeah, I take the credit. Yeah. All right, the intake is in. So we're gonna take up the JB4, and then we're gonna get the laptop and flash the car with the boot mode three, and let's see how she does. Then we're gonna rip this bitch till she drips. Oh yeah. Get to work. Uh, <laughs> Say what again? Let's not do that, please. Okay, let's not do that. You like this bitch. Let's just show the drip only. If you don't work on your car, are you in a car guy? Nope. Alright, so to open up the JB4, you're gonna have to open that wire up that was on the other side. It's gonna look something like this yellowish. Then open this one up. That's what? Whitish? Brownish. Brownish. And yeah, so it's like brownish. But you gonna you can't kinda see this right here. That's where it goes. Open that up. Maybe. Just don't break it, open it. <laughs> It's gonna be a bad day. All right, there it goes. If you guys wanna buy this J before, let me know. I'll shoot you guys a good price. It comes with the Bluetooth, right? Bluetooth. Bluetooth. And uh, the USB cable also. Okay. So if you guys want it, let me know. DM me on my Instagram, or, or you could even comment down below. And uh, if it's not sold by then, then you guys got it. And don't play around. Please only serious buyers if you're gonna buy it. Then the, that sensor comes out. Then you plug the OEM back in. I think that's it, right? That's it. Yeah. And then you just take this part out and then your wires go through that and the JB4 is hiding it. Hiding behind it. Okay, JB4 is right here. And then we're gonna take out the JB4. I'm not gonna record all that. I'm gonna just get to the boot mode 3 now. And then you put your cover back on because you're not doing anything on the engine on the boot mode 3 and get your laptop and get to work. So after you're uh, taking off the JB4 or whatever, then you come back into your car and uh, we're gonna install the boot mode. So basically, first you send them an email, right? So you send them an email and then buy, you buy... Buy the tune, they send you a licensing key. You put that in, plug your car in and start flashing. Okay, all right, and first flash you go to, go to what? So we're doing stage two E30. That's where we bought stage two. And get you tune. Get tune. I'm just gonna download it. So this is flashing to your car? This is downloading right now. Okay. And then I'll flash it afterwards. Alright, so... And then press... So OTS maps. OTS maps. And... We're going to get stage 2 E30. Mm -hmm. Where'd you go? To the menu? Just to my maps. Menu, menu and my maps. And my maps. All right. And all the tunes you have downloaded here. Mm -hmm. You just go stage two. Stage two. And hit flash. Hit flash. And uh, before you guys uh, hit flash, make sure your seatbelt's on and your doors uh, doors are closed. And don't open them. Don't open them, right? And uh, windows are up, maybe that too. Oh, no. It doesn't matter. Okay. okay. Here we go. You're gonna get these signs 
but don't worry about it because like you know this is just your cars you know reprogramming uh, reprogramming the the ecu and everything so it doesn't matter there it goes it's three percent already it's gonna go up 200 right and then we'll see what's up then we're gonna go on a drive and see uh what's the difference on the car and see uh how much better and uh, what else can we notice between jv4 and the budmo 3 all right we are at 92 complete three come on buddy five six seven eight nine ten 100 already and it's finishing up So quiet. <laughs> there it is. Some sounds. Some more signs, right? I'm just clearing the codes right now. Okay. Hurry the fuck up. <laughs> We're gonna go to go oh, for a drive. <laughs> secondary codes and uh, I think I forgot to tell you guys make sure you, before you start all that make sure you plug the OBD yeah. port in that's the main thing buddy <laughs> yeah then you turn it off right so after it says success you turn off the button wait like five seconds five seconds and start it up then start up the car <laughs> that was the the radar that's it. That's it? Yep. All right. So now we're going to go for a drive and go get some gas. My cousin's the, cousin's the one who's not going to be driving. It's going to be the sun driver again. We're going to go find him. I don't know where he is. <laughs> we're probably going to go to Mexico and get some uh, gas and we'll come back. Love the pops. Not a ladder, huh? Yeah, I feel them. And they're like, I feel them they the used too. Yeah, they used to be deeper, mm. but like now they're like more. Yep, I can tell the difference. <laughs> I can tell the difference. This bitch folds. This bitch folds. I don't know if you can hear the pops now, but they're loud as fuck. <laughs> okay, no pops. What the fuck? <laughs> no, no pops. No, oh, sorry. Poles, bro. It pulls, yeah, it's faster. Oh, that was the loudest one. That was the loudest we might have to check the intake again. Remember the last time? <laughs> last time it popped so hard that my intake broke. I don't know if you guys remember that video. Yep, that's loud. Okay. Check. I mean, the boot mode 3 is worth it, you guys. It's better than JP4. Get the boot mode 3. <laughs> Fuck you before. Alright, so how are these are tires? 375 or 275s? 275s. The, this car has uh, 275 tires on it, and you guys already seen the rims are pretty clean. But this, even the fronts aren't uh, wide too, right? 255s. Yeah, so the car still doesn't have no fucking grip. Like, no grip whatsoever. 
That's even with the JP42, but the boot mode 3 is like fucking quick. You can't feel the power. So it's better than if you want to waste money, waste money on the boot mode 3. <laughs> Yep, yep, <laughs> worth it, totally worth it. Can you guys hear the turbo? Because the intake, the turbo that sounds nice too. <laughs> Yo, how long your tires last you? It's fine, huh? <laughs> Not very long, huh? <laughs> the 392 one. God damn, bro! <laughs> oh, nice E36, 46, shit. I forget my car on <laughs> the E36. And this is without the double uh, burble tube, right? Uh, oh, this is within it. With it? Oh. Bro, I can't wait until mine's wrapped already. That bitch is nice. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? That car is clean, bro. I can't get over it. Mine's gonna look something like this. And the pops. Oh! No pops. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Another day in California driving around with the pops. Huh? No big deal. No big deal. Nothing. What? Do that again? Yo, that's like the actual actual gunshot sound. Do it again? Alright guys, that's it for today's video. And uh, as you guys already know, now we have a JP4. I don't know what the fuck is that? Boot mod 3. Thank you. So now we have a boot mod 3 on the F30, and this is not my F30. I still have the JV4. I might have to go with the boot mod 3 now. And uh, this JV4 that we had on the 340, it's on sale. So if you guys want it, hit me up, and I'll give you guys the prices and everything. And thank you so much for watching. Peace out. Next video is gonna be on the F uh, Alpha, and Alpha is gonna be making these bobs too. And we'll see you guys next with this right here. Peace. And uh, we can't show you the stunt driver. Sorry.